this is how to create busier curve in your Flutter app. I just want to shout out Bazoo and Learn App Code for this documentation. Thank you and let's start this. The first thing we need is to create a file called the custom clippers. Inside this one, we have the import material. Then we create a class big clipper. This one is the orange shape. The big clipper will extend a custom clipper with the type path. We will also create a class small clipper. This one is the red shape. And now you can see that we have a problem. We need to go over the big clipper, quick fix, and then create the two missing override. And we will do the same thing for the small clipper. Quick fix, create two missing override. Next, we need to create the path get clip. For this, you will need to open all your shapes in Google Chrome. You see, I have the big clipper and the small clipper. Also, you need to make sure that it's a .svg file. With this, you can right click and inspect. This will give you the path of the SVG. Then you can find online a SVG converter to Flutter code. I will link all the resource in the description. So what you need is to put the path of the SVG. I will go back inside the inspect and I will double click, copy the path and paste it inside. Next, we need also the translation X and Y. You can also find this in the inspect. This is the X and this is the Y. So I will copy both of them and I will click convert. This will give us the flutter clipper. So you will just take all the override, you will copy this and inside your code you will replace the get clip. So all of this by what you just copy. Simple as that. Next, we need to do the same thing, but for the small clipper. Right click, inspect, copy the path and the translation and click convert. Again, I copy all the override and I replace the override path get clip inside the small clipper this time. That's perfect. So the small clipper is the shape of the red one and the big clipper is the shape of the orange one. Now I will create a scaffold. I will give a background color red with a body stack. Inside the list of children, we have the clip path the clipper will be the big clipper and the child will be a container with the orange color. And this is what we have. I will also make another clip path with the clipper small clipper this time, the child container with a color red. That's cool, but we have a problem. We need to have a shadow on the big clipper and the small clipper. For this, we have a perfect solution on GitHub by Happy Iris. And thank you a lot. Your code is now mine. I will copy all of this and I will create a new file called the clip shadow path. In this one, I will copy the code from Iris and I after some modification to make it work with null safety, we can now use the clip shadow path. I will add all this code inside the first comment of this video. If you want, you can read it, but this is pretty boring. So we will just use it as it is. And for this, we will replace the clip path by the clip shadow path that we have just used. This one need to have an argument shadow, which we will give a bug shadow with the color black, the offset, the blur radius, and the spread radius. And this create a shadow under the big clipper shape. We will do the same thing for the other one. We change the clip path for the clip shadow path. We add a shadow with the bug shadow and you have created two busier shape inside your Flutter app. This Saturday the 19th, I will release my new advanced Flutter course. It will be straight to the point like these videos and we will talk about clean architecture, testing Flutter apps, performance and widget lifecycle. The pre-sale of the course will start this Saturday the 19th and you will be able to get the course at $38 instead of $69. After the pre-sale, the course will never be in discount. So this is your only chance to get it at $38. And I'm so sure that it will be the best advanced course that you have ever take, that you have a 30 day satisfaction guaranteed or your money back. The pre-sale will start this Saturday the 19th and if you want to get notified by email when it's ready, you can click the link in the description or go on fluttermap.com. YouTube algorithm think you should watch this video next. That's it. Thank you for watching. Bye.